is Amanda Winters. I'm a former operative of the government's hidden arm, known as the Faction. I am the best there is at counter-terrorism. I have been on the run for two years, having been accused of crimes I haven't committed. I need to clear my name. At least your aim has improved. Really? On a bench in the middle of a park. And you're reading The Art of War. Never let it be said that I don't like a good cliché. And I see you made the front page. Nothing like a good story. Yeah, well I doubt the director would agree with that. He is very grateful for your efforts over there. Said you did one hell of a job. Is that official? As official as it can be. Next time, keep it low key. That was low key. Well, for me, anyway. Your next assignment Khalil Azim. He was a small times arms dealer based in Melbourne, but recently he's got his hands on the launch codes to some A grade weaponry out of Malaysia. Mission simple neutralise the target and get those codes. Now, the target will be in his hotel room at exactly 1800 hours. Light security detail, two bodyguards, armed of course. Now this is to be a complete rapid tap, no witnesses. The extraction point will be in the hotel car park, silver hatchback, the key will be on the front passenger side wheel. Any backup? No harm in asking, right? I don't make the rules, I'm just the messenger. Now this is priority one from the director himself, so make sure everything goes smoothly. Well, that's it. He's looking at you, kid. Because that line just doesn't get old, does it? Time for some new material, old man. Sharp, 8411. But Project Raven has been established, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. resources every time we send our troops out there. They are causing more harm than good. We need to fetch them home. Listen, 
What about the reports of this so-called faction that's targeting our allies in the Middle East? <laughs> the Israelis think our government is responsible. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, we came here to discuss budget, not to get into World War Three. Andrew, you've been very silent on this subject. What, what's your opinion of this debacle? Well, Gary, in my opinion, I support the troops 100%, no matter what they're there for. And if this so-called faction did exist, surely we'd know about it, especially the people in this room. Excuse me. No, no, let's go back to the point, okay? No, the point is that you're going to get out of the way. Let's go back to the Sir, sorry to disturb you. I figured you should be the first to see this. Has anyone else seen this? No, sir. I want to assemble a team to tackle this right away. Go through the ASIO channels, falsify whatever documents you need, and keep this to our people only. Assemble the team at the apartment complex. Do we have any assets in the area? Yes, sir, Billix team. They're already there, ready and waiting. Good. Get them prepped, then proceed with transport to the complex. Yes, sir. Director? Has she said anything? No, sir. Billick and his men picked her up at Circular Quay. CCTV picked her up at the ferry. She didn't even try and run. I want you to kill all the cameras in that room. Sir? Kill the cameras right now! Thank you, gentlemen. My team will take over now. My men will escort you from the building. Sir, is this legal? Son, do you know who she is? So I don't need to remind you how dangerous she is, do I? She is a traitor to the Australian people. As far as I'm concerned, she has no rights. Does that make my point clear, gentlemen? It's been a long time, Widders. I think the last time I saw you was before you went into the field. When was that? Four years ago? To be honest, I'm surprised you came back. It took a lot of guts to come back. Hell, even sharp. You don't get to say his name. Not you. Always wondered about you two. You were the first recruit, Sharp wanted to stay with, begged me to assign you to him. He was a good man. Is that why you had him killed? According to the tabloids, you killed him. Just like you killed that federal agent two years back. You know that's utter bullshit. I was in Madrid when Sharp was killed. But you already knew that. Just like you knew on my last mission, the target was not an arms dealer. Getting other people to do your dirty work, you make me sick. A 
why don't we continue when you're a little more relaxed? Have fun, you two. I guarantee when I finish with you, you'll be begging me to kill you. It's only a matter of time. Switch the cameras back on. Let's see if they're making friends. Find her, now! We have to go now. You always were a pain in the ass. Shut up! Shut up! Two years I've been running. Two years! Why didn't you tell me about the agent? All the intel we got said he was undercover. I swear! Don't even... Tell me the truth. Okay, okay. Carlin, or whoever he was, was investigating the faction. He was trying to get hard evidence on us. You were an asset that shouldn't even exist! Why not bring him in yourself? I did. What was right? By the nation. By killing him? How does that help anyone? Oh, please. Don't act all innocent. Your hands are as dirty as mine. I did what I had to do. The faction has achieved more in seven years than the government has in 30. If one person dies so that thousands live, so be it. I am serving my country. Not anymore. You don't get off that easy. You're gonna to have to account for everything. You're on your own.
sorry, kid. Playing my part. At least your aim has improved. 